What's up guys, this is James the First and welcome back to more Let's Play Sly Cooper and Devious Raccoonus. And I don't know why the chasing sound is on, but alright. Last episode we did We uh, started on Mesa City. Uh, we did two levels so far, we got two out of the whatever keys. This episode we're gonna grab some more keys while grabbing some coins on the way. And yeah, let's just go into this one. And as you can see, Murray's Big Gamble. There's no clue bottles, just the key. Let's just go on forward. Murray is in position to make a run for this key. Okay, so what do I do? Provide some covering fire for him with that blasting station. Sweet. Use the left analog stick to aim and press the square button to fire. I'll do my best. Alright, so we got our first similar mini game to uh, the the crab one from the first from Raleigh's world. Terror, I got stuck calling it that. So yeah, we got we got some mini games. I think they're a good change of pace from doing regular levels. Also, you see those radioactive ones. You want to miss them, or you want to try not to hit them. And don't hit Murray. Oh, that's pretty neat. I never knew that. Uh, you don't want to accidentally hit it. Just continue to shoot these guys. And yeah, you can see Murray in his nerd outfit. Uh, watch out, Murray. So yeah, this is... When I was practicing, I actually got a game over on this. <laughs> which is pretty funny. Also, if you get a game over, you just get five lives and you're back to the start level you were doing. And yeah, if you if you die here, you gotta start the whole thing over. Similar with all the levels, unless the checkpoints matter, which I'm not sure. And one try. We didn't even get hit on that, which is crazy. <laughs> so yeah, I guess this is Murray's episode. Since spoiler, the other level is, is mainly Murray too. Which I think is a good change of pace. You know, it's, I don't have to worry about missing a clue bottle or something like that. I don't know what the chasing music was on really early in the episode, but hey. And we're only at three minutes, which I thought that. I thought I would die a bunch, but I guess I'm getting better by replaying the game. I'm not sure though. I think you're. I think it's hard to commentate while playing a game. Which I can now understand how those YouTubers do it, which is crazy. <laughs> Murray, what's going on down there? Well, I drove to this hot dog stand for a quick snack. Is that a guy's face you know, on the hot dog? By these gangster dogs. Like an actual human you face? For the winner? Yeah, mm -hmm. three times around the track for a key. It's all you, man. Drive the van with the left analog stick. And if you manage to pick up any nitro power-ups, you can get a boost by pressing the square button. Go get him! I'm on it! So let's just go slide carding uh, PS2 or 3. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> I was trying to go for a Mario Kart reference, but it didn't exactly work out. And, wow. I thought I was doing bad, but these guys are just flipping on their own. So yeah, you just want to get first place, or or not. You know, I could I could deal with fifth place. Move out of the way, you purple thing. Fourth place, 
Sorry if I'm being a little bit quiet. I'm just trying to concentrate here so I don't mess up. Plus the music's pretty catchy. If you go up ramps like that, you can get a little bit of extra speed. Like three Chihuahuas in the second car, or the car in second place. So that's pretty crazy. Oh, it looks like it. Alright, and we're on the last lap. This episode might be short, the shortest one yet. Yeah, hopefully not. So we're in second place. We did it. I guess it's Murray's day today. shorter than I expected. I should have done the, the level we did last episode, like with the Murray level. I was saving like these two levels for like <laughs> a Murray themed episode or something like that. But yeah, we did everything we could in this area. So let's just do what Sly was thinking about. Whoopa! Get all the coins here. Lots of money. Lots of big money. And let's just continue onward into the casino. And so yeah, <laughs> I didn't, I didn't figure this would be like a slow episode. Would you look at that ugly mug? I am. And I find it infinitely fascinating. Huh? My x-ray detection devices reveal that a secret elevator to Mugshot's penthouse is contained within that giant head. So how do we get in? Behind this locked wall, there's a lever that summons the elevator. But you need all seven keys to open it up. I'm on it. Yeah, that's why I said you want to get every key in every level, because it's like the same thing in the Tide of Terror. But, I guess that's it, since I'm not really ready to do these levels, since I haven't practiced yet. And I don't want to go into them blind, but next time on Let's Play Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus, we're going to go into these, maybe all three levels. Who knows? Maybe two or three. I don't know. See you guys then.